run in Northeast Florida. We're a program for third through fifth grade girls that um, is a curriculum based program that meets twice a week for an hour and 15 minutes and as they're doing the curriculum they learn about self-esteem, healthy living, body image, community service and cooperation and they train for a 5k at the end. So 8 to 11 year olds, about 700 a season, run a 5k. Girls Inc. is a national nonprofit organization that works with girls ages 5 to 18. We have been in Jacksonville since 1970 and we work with girls that are in underserved uh, areas. We have after school, summer camp, and outreach programs. And all of our programs are nationally uh, researched and evaluated by our national staff and given to each affiliate to deliver to our girls. turning 100 this year. We have a lot of exciting opportunities and we look forward to seeing you out there. Hi, my name is Liz Butler and I'm from the Women in Business Society. Um, Women in Business Society is for women and men, whoever wants to join, that is, um, we encourage them to pursue higher professional achievement and we help them with networking and career opportunities. So come out and see what we have to offer. Well, I'm uh, glad to be here from Susan G. Cole. And um, this affiliate in North Florida is 16 years old. We've got our big race coming up on Saturday. Uh, the mission of Susan G. Coleman is involves breast cancer awareness and support for testing, screening, treatment for women who are underinsured or don't have any insurance. Uh, we do a lot of education work and a lot of uh, breast cancer awareness work. Um, it's an incredible organization that has done some amazing work over the years, and I'm excited to be part of it. My name is Bruce Grove, and I'm the executive director for North Florida Susan G. Coleman for the Cure. And I want to thank the Volunteer Center and thank all of you for being here. And, and uh, I'm excited to have a chance to uh, tell you briefly about uh, Susan G. Coleman. And eight women will be uh, diagnosed with breast cancer. Every three minutes, a woman will be diagnosed with breast cancer. This year, 40,000 women will die of breast cancer. And this year, over 500 men will die of breast cancer as well. It's not just women. In those 29 years, Susan G. Cohen has invested $1.9 billion in research. There's been, um, there's hardly been a, a, an advancement in breast cancer research or treatment or testing that hasn't been touched by Cohen dollars uh, in those 29 years. Cohen's focus, we do two things. Um, the bulk of the funding that gets raised here 75% um, of the money that's raised here stays here in North Park, in the five county area. And uh, the focus of that is helping to fund screening, testing, treatment, education, advocacy, breast cancer awareness in these five county areas. Um, most of the advances in breast cancer treatment have come as a result of early detection. And so the need for testing and screening is huge, and the availability of that testing and screening is not always easy.